Hello and welcome to my video on how to make a small scale um, jet engine. It uh, looks like this. Well to in the end. Um, so you got your battery, I'll explain how that all mess about at the end. Not mess about, you just happen to say that. So the things that you'll need are, just pick them up, you're going to need six of these skewers, skewers, can't even say that, skewers, um, which you get on a barbecue, they've got a pointy end, um, and uh, you can pick them up in a supermarket or whatever, shops, um, you're going to need two pencils with flat ends like this, you don't want it with a rubber on, uh, it doesn't matter what pencil either, um, you don't want it with a pointy end, you want both sides like this. Okay. Um, you're going to need some sellotape, three elastic bands, a motor, one of these motors, and a 9 volt battery. Okay, so step one, you're going to need your six skewers. skewers. I may end up saying skewers throughout the video, but please forgive me. I just can't say it properly. Well, I can, but whatever. Um, and what you need to do is, because they've got a sharp end, you need to cut off that, but you need to measure it with your pencil. Okay, so I've already cut this off in preparation for the video. Um, and you need to put your pencil up to the uh, skewer. Skewer, that's it, I said it properly that time. Um, so you have it with the bot, you align the flat bit um, on the bottom of the skewers with the bottom of the pencil and you just basically snip off the end so your pencil's this big by the way I've got a rubber in there but I'm not actually making the thing so that's why you don't need to, uh, you don't want a rubber on there like I said um so you got it a line like that look so that's like that then you just go up and to the top of the pencil and then you, about there you just snip um off the ends of the skewer um so uh, that bit's a little bit difficult. Hang so. So once you cut that off, it you're gonna get some heads like this, which you're not gonna need. So you can chuck them in the bin. Um, once you've to cut through them, you're gonna need a hacksaw or a saw, or you can just use scissors, mark it out slightly, and then just snap it, which is what I've done. Then you it's gonna come out a little bit jagged. Uh, like that probably so you might want to sand that down but I'm not going to bother um, so you've got your six skewers with the ends off um, now you get your two uh, fat now you get three of these skewers skewers and you get one of the elastic bands fat now you get the sellotape I don't know whether I said you'll need sellotape but sorry I apologise for that too um, you need the sellotape and you get these three and you align them a bit like uh, almost like a pyramid sort of thing like this okay and you sellotape at the bottom um, and so at the bottom round here round about there and at the top round about there so you'll have them together like this uh, sellotaped and you do that with the other three, so you'll have them like that too. Um, so you got those two like that, and then what you do there with them is you then attach those two together with sellotape. So you got those two, uh, three skewers attached together like that. You got two of them, um, and you then I'm sellotape these by the way, um, and then you just attach them together and sellotape around there and there um, and you should come out with something well it'll be like that okay um, and then from there so using sellotape <laughs> you um, sellotape a pencil onto one side like this and one on the other too so you'll have it so you'll sellotape them all together and it'll be something like that which isn't much of a help but you've got the instructions so you know what it looks like <clears throat> and then you basically just um, attach the motor you bring the motor 
up to the edge of there um, of your little base if you want but at the bottom with the skewers and the pencils and you take the motor up to the end and then you just tape round a few times with the sellotape so it's secure and then you get your third in fact you won't you need to use the elastic bands yet but whatever you get one of your elastic bands and you put it round the battery like that so you put the battery in place and then you just go round girls will know how to do this because they can do it with the hair uh, with the elastic, no, with the band things that they use, don't know what they are, uh, hair thingies, and um, you just put it on, and then you twist it round, and then you put it over again, so, how can I demonstrate, if I got these skewers, it would help if this elastic band was in one piece, but it's not, because I just snapped it, um, you just put it on like that, mm, you can't see that, just bear with me a second, I'll just uh, get another elastic band. Play some music while she's waiting or something. Here we go. So you've got your elastic bands like this. And you've got your pencil or what you got your base thing. I keep calling it a base. Um, so imagine this is the base bit at the bottom. You should put slide it on. So you got the thing, the motor at the end here, and your battery about here. Then you put this on. Uh, this is really cheap. Uh, if imagine this is your battery basically. <laughs> um, I know it's hard. Let's use the lid. It's a little bit easier to imagine. So this is your battery. You put it on. You've got the motor here. And you basically, you put the battery on. Uh, the uh, elastic band on like this. So it's on top of the battery. Around the pencil. You then twist it round. You go back over the pencil. And on top of the uh, elastic band again. Then you just keep doing that until it's secure. And then you'll have something like this. So you can slide the battery forwards and it will connect up to the motor and make this end bit spin. That sounds really weird probably, but that's just the motor spinning. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool and there's your jet engine. Should come out something like that um, and uh, go off and play with it basically. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please comment, rate and subscribe. Bye.